And how long have you been working with NetUp as part of your uh, as part of your environment? Um, we started working with NetUp about four years ago, maybe five years ago, um, just as we were really starting to work on development of uh, Hyper-V uh, version one for Super 2008. Awesome. And has NetUp been involved in the development of Hyper-V? Yeah, absolutely. Um, so we've been working with NetUp ever since then. Um, we certainly have worked with NetApp around how, how best to manage storage for Hyper-V, um, learning about how enterprise class SANs function in uh, customer environments. So yeah, definitely. Have there been any capabilities that NetApp has offered that you've been particularly impressed by when you've been working with NetApp storage? I think probably in general my biggest um, you know, impression is that NetApp has been able to rapidly evolve and meet some of the needs that the customers have and that our, our partners are, you know, that we're looking for. Um, so stuff like the ability to do a, uh, present a file as a one um, is incredibly powerful as it pertains to this virtual, you know, rapid provisioning. Um, you know, getting things like Snapdrive integration for Hyper-V done shortly after a release really enables our customers to go get onto that release quickly and take advantage of the new features that are there. So you mentioned rapid provisioning. Um, have you seen any results using NetApp with rapid provisioning in your labs? Um, we certainly have used it in our lab, um, partly as a test process and partly as a uh, proof of concept application. So being able to provision large numbers of VMs very quickly uh, with efficient use of storage, right? So we're not copying the same 60 gig or 100 gig file over and over and over again, but you know, being able to use one base and deploy those very rapidly, we've certainly take advantage of that. Excellent. And you know, earlier when we were looking at some of the results in your lab, you mentioned you were seeing some really impressive savings with deduplication. Can you talk a little bit about that? Yeah, so certainly with, um, with fixed VHDs, which is our recommendation for performance and uh, reliability, deduplication it can be amazingly efficient because it can take away all the zeros that are in those files. Um, also, we tend to have a lot of copies of the same VHD or similar VHD, so you do kicks in and takes care of that very effectively. So we've seen volumes at 80% DDUP savings. That's awesome. DDUP savings. I'm looking for um, Awesome. Um, looking for um, looking for um, looking for
Awesome. 